Supporting actress. Here we go. My uh, favorite category, almost by by a mile. Well, but every year, it's 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 this wonderful train wreck of different kinds of actresses and different kinds of performances. It's the one wild card area of yeah. the Oscars, reliably. Bernice Bejo for the artist, Jessica Chastain for the help, Melissa McCarthy for Bridesmaids. I should do my movie phone voice. No, Janet McTeer <laughs> for Albert Nobbs. Yes, press five. Octavia Spencer for the help. I'll open your envelope. You chose Melissa McCarthy. Yes, rather, uh, you know, uh, perversely, but I honestly feel that's that your favorite one. That part gave me so much joy, uh, and there was so much sort of just creative juice that went into it. I would, she's never going to win. She will never win for this performance. She might win, you know, if she plays a serious role someday. But I, I would no. I mean, well, God forbid. Exactly. Anyway, open my. I, I, I beg to differ. Uh, the, act the supporting actress Wesley Fields should win is the person who probably will win, Octavia Spencer. It's a woman yeah. sort of wrestling with a stereotype that she it knows. It could have been so easily a cartoon. She's playing. Right. She's the person in this movie who knows what they're doing and writing this book is is extremely risky, but just doesn't care, and it's just like you know what it has to happen. Mm -hmm. She conforms to a body type that Hollywood has managed to institutionally poison us against. Right. It's the first time that you've seen that body type and person humanized, humanized in a in an actorly way. That's supporting actress. I'm Ty Burr. I'm Wesley Morris for the Boston Globe.